Mr. Westbrook, I thought our business was complete. Well, it is. But you didn't think I was going to walk away so easily, did you? Well, I'd like to think so, seeing how I've worked for you for many years and I've showed you nothing but my loyalty. Yes, you have worked for me for many years and you have been very loyal and I'm thankful for that. Well, okay. All that being said, what is the purpose of this phone call? When I came to visit you and I offered you my empire and I said to you, keep 80% of the profits, you said no thank you. You see, Roderick, the day you turned me down was the day you became my enemy. Oh, I see. So all the things that I've done for you over the years and all the times I've had your back just don't mean anything? Is that what you're telling me? If you're not with me, then you're against me, just like all my other enemies. So after all these years, I'm supposed to continue to work for you and disregard my personal feelings for what I want to do with my life? I'm just trying to understand your reasoning behind all this. Please paint a more clear picture for me. The picture couldn't be more clear, my dear enemy. So when you said you consider us friends, that was all bullshit. No, I really thought you would take my offer. I really thought you were my friend. When you turned me down, it hurt my feelings. And that's not an easy thing to do. So now that I'm considered your enemy, let the chips fall where they may. Yo, Deep. So, Rod, what's up? It's going down. You got the green light to go ahead and break my client. So, when you want me to do it? Whenever you're ready. Bet. Yo, Spider, y'all ready? My girl's always ready. Yo, Raven. You ready? Hell yeah, I'm ready. I've been waiting to get down. Yo, Phantom. You're kind of young for this crew. Yup. People always underestimate me. Yo, Gift. You looking like you ready. And you know this. Native soul. You've been with us a long time. You ready? No, I was born ready. And Python, I know you ready. Not only am I ready deep, I can't wait to take my uncle down. Okay, ladies of Spiderweb, today I want to say thank you for having my back and my boss's back. He asked that each and every one of you show up today because he wanted to personally meet you. So ladies, meet Mr. Roderick Factor, the guy you have been protecting. Well, ladies, it's nice to see all of you. You all are skilled in many ways. And let me tell you, those skills are of an even greater need right now. There's gonna be a bonus for each and every one of you. A generous bonus. When this is over. We got your back 100. It's my pleasure to protect you, sir. We got your back. Always a pleasure, sir. 
It's a pleasure to finally meet you, sir. I've always admired how you work, so it's my pleasure to guard your back, Roger. Yo, Python. Now that everybody just stepped out, let me kick it with you for a minute. Now, I know this is uh, kind of personal for you. Are you sure you're ready for this? Business is business. Okay. Bet. Let's rock and roll. Don't be offended. No one's ever seen my face. And that's the way I like to keep it. We good? Of course we are. Very nice of you to meet with me. Welcome to my home. The pleasure is all mine, sir. As agreed upon, the money has been wired to your account. Now let's discuss business. So tell me, what is old boy Factor up to? He's planning to take out your businesses. You might want to get some extra men stationed at all three locations. They're scheduled to do this on Saturday, so move quick. Very well, then. Is there anything else I can assist you with, sir? No, not at this time. And I trust that what you're telling me is the truth. Because if I find out that what you're telling me is not true, you will no longer be with us. We good? Yes, we are. 